police is on. How y'all doing tonight? Y'all ready for some fun tunes? This can probably come down just a hair there, Dylan. Thank you, thank you, friend. Well, we are Buffalo Fiasco. We're going to kick things off here for you. What do you want to kick it off with, Evie? Well, let's do a little bit of Know You Rider right. after the bass gets in tune. For once, we're waiting on the bass to tune, not the banjo. It's wet out there. banjo jokes, but tonight I might just get to insert bass. It's an unassailable instrument. You can't possibly know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, you want to slow this one down, I think? I don't like to go slow. All right. <laughs>
I say we're Buffalo Fiasco from right here in Knoxville, Tennessee. Happy to be here tonight. I think I need a bigger water bottle. This one's only 40 ounces. We're going to do one now. Uh, so I grew up in North Dakota, and there's not a whole lot of bluegrass that happens up there. Really? What I know it's really surprising, but... Uh, but I used to travel around with my daddy a lot. Uh, he put on this bluegrass festival and he always was like, well, you can come with, but you have to learn a song on the way. We had a big old Astro van. I'd sit in the front seat playing fiddle while he drove around. And this is, here's one of the ones that, man, Astro vans are great. This here's one of them tunes that I learned sitting in that front seat called Back Up and Push. preface by saying that uh, no personal experience went into the making of this song whatsoever and I never tell a lie. Also, if you have anyone in your life that uh, you need this song sung to, I do make personal deliveries. I bring along my own personal bodyguard in case it goes wrong. Here's why. Thank you. 
every smile, every laugh makes me wish we'd not score. Well, my heart was yours right from the start. In the end, you tore it apart. As the days passed me by, the waters dry. I never see you again Say that you love me If that were true Why did you choose someone new? I hope I never see you that you need that uh, singing telegram sent to, just let me know. Be happy to make that happen for you. <laughs> All right. June Apple. Yeah. Take a quick second and introduce these fellers up here. Holding that mandolin down and picking some mighty fine guitars, Mr. Cameron Cornette. <laughs> Playing some banjo. A little bit of guitar. Doing some mighty fine singing for you here in a little bit. Would y'all make welcome Mr. Garrett Gregg. <laughs> Providing all of your elevator music needs in your life, Mr. Dave Rasnick on the bass. My name's Evie. We're, here's a tune called June Apple.
All right, let me grab this banjo here for a second. Well, you might need it for more than a second. Uh, I'm just saying. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hey, I don't have it put out, but if you guys like us, we got some t-shirts and some uh, little EP CDs. Uh, just find me afterwards or I'll find a spot to throw our suitcase up. And The t-shirts are kind of fun. They're, they feature a buffalo sitting on a telephone wire. <laughs> That's the fiasco. <laughs> yeah. My favorite part that I made sure that, so Cameron's buddy drew it for us, and I was like, I want one bird that's like hanging on for dear life by them. So there's like one bird like upside down hanging on by like one little claw. That's my favorite part of the whole shirt, I think. It's like that big. My favorite part. It happens. All right. Yeah. Sing this one. Yeah, I'm awake now.
We got any Patsy Klein fans out in the house tonight? I always like when I ask that and I get an answer. Sometimes I don't get an answer and it makes my heart a little sad that people don't love the Patsy as much as I do. Uh, this next one is one of my favorites of hers. We're, we're, we're reconfigurating. Just keep, keep talking. Okay. I never really know what's happening behind me sometimes. That's probably for the best. I just kind of roll with it in my life. It makes, you know. <laughs> this one scares me sometimes. So a few years ago, I decided it would be a brilliant idea to throw all of these boys, well, not this one, a different, different banjo picker, in a van and drive up to North Dakota to play a bluegrass festival. And um, it was going pretty well until we got to Skyline Chili Land, and this one wanted to stop and get some, and that was maybe three hours into a 20-hour van ride, and getting getting a lot of folks eating chili and then throwing them back in a van is not the best idea in the world. <laughs> Are we ready yet? <laughs> Please. Right, I've been on you. I don't know what you're doing. All right, here we go. Keep talking. here saying we're, we're making it up as we go and I said that's the story of my life all right the next two we got coming up for you is a nice slow uh, lazy instrumental 
you know, it's it's really good to uh, relax and meditate too. Um, yeah, I use it. Maybe fall morning, asleep. Morning meditations. Yeah, falling asleep. Yep. Yep. It's like uh, it's all all those things and more. Peaceful. I describe it. Yeah. Yep. Floating down the river. Mm-hmm. <laughs> for having us out tonight. Thank you guys for coming out tonight. We appreciate that. Thanks for listening. We've played the empty rooms and it's way more fun to have people out there. I'm just saying. You know? This this interaction is a lot easier. The empty rooms seem to enjoy us more, however. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a this is a little mashup tune that uh, Garrett came up with and it's a it's pretty fun. We call it Ruby Rubin because those are the names of the two songs. <laughs> yep. Ruby and Reuben. One's about a train and one's about a woman. <laughs> hey! <laughs> well, I can never seem to catch a train or the woman, so... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
try and get along with you, still you're not satisfied.
all so much.